if you're looking for someone to fetch your next drink, maybe hire a donkey. Uh, yeah, live. <laughs> yeah, listen, the owners of the Drunken Borough, uh, they're here to tell you about their mobile bar. Molly, good morning. Hi, Molly. Yes, good morning. So I just want you to picture yourself. Okay, okay. You're, you're at a wedding. Ceremony's over, headed to the reception uh -huh. spot. You are greeted by the best servers in the biz miniature donkeys. Oh, well, thank you, Cerveza. I appreciate that. Um, I want to introduce to you the brilliant minds behind the Drunken Borough Mobile Bar Bartending and Beer Burrows. This is just one of six burrows that you have. Haley and Nick Dutton. Um, as I said, brilliant. So you are a mobile bartending bar cart. You yep. travel, uh, do events, and then you have these little helpers as well. Yes, yeah. These are our beer burrows, so we do mobile bartending out of our trailer, and then we serve bottled drinks off of our burrows. Okay. And of course, the mobile bartending, that's a big part of it. And I was telling you, like, this alone, this is awesome. I mean, this would be great at an event. Uh, what kind of cocktail, I mean, what do you offer, Nick? We offer pretty much anything between beer and wine, two signature cocktails, or even a full bar. So we'll serve whatever you want and cater to your likings. Okay. So it's a matter of we'll serve whatever you guys want served. Perfect. So. Well, my likings are miniature donkeys. <laughs> <laughs> and as we yeah. saw, we just had a, a little fashion show of them. So how does it work, Kaylee? Uh, you can pick the bar and or one or two donkeys usually? Yeah, so the bar and the burrows can be booked together separately, and then we go together and we plan everything in the bar. Um, we pick your cocktails, I help you pick out quantities. Um, we go over everything that you'll need for that day, and then you get to pick whatever donkey you want. We have a choice between six of them, and then you get to pick like what they're wearing. So we have different <laughs> themes, we have the possibilities are endless. Yeah. <laughs> could we have them walk by again and we can kind of introduce them and talk to them? So first we have this beautiful unicorn. <laughs> yeah. That's Brandy. Come over here, Brandy. And as she's walking by, I do want to point out, we were talking about this. They're extremely social animals. They're, they're work animals. I mean, this is a job that they really enjoy doing. Oh yeah, they are like, he is my baby and he just absolutely loves all the attention, lives for it. And so it just makes it easy. They, they're not really working. They're getting attention the whole time. Yeah. yeah, and they just love it. Okay, so that's Brandy right there. That's Paloma. In our Fiesta package. Okay, that's our Fiesta package. The tiny donkey in the tiny hat, by the way. Uh, over here, this is Vino, who I have been told may be the biggest lover of them all, just wants to be scratched. And then the newest member of the squad this is Margarita, or Little Rita. Margarita's almost a year old. Yes, yes. Haley. So right now, <laughs> I'm like, oh my gosh, a mini, mini, a baby mini donkey. Baby mini. Are you kidding me? So right now you'll notice she is not dressed up. She's too young for that. So right yeah, now she's just available for photo shoots. Yes, yeah, uh, available for photos and socializing. When she hits two, then she'll be able to work. Okay. And she is Paloma's little baby. And look, Cervase is like, wait, why are you petting the other one? I want some scratches. We have a baby on the way. So mm -hmm. Martini is due in May. So we'll have another little tiny, tiny baby coming in there. Hopefully. I mean, I mean, this whole time, this is how I've been like, I just like can't really get over this. <laughs> it's so amazing. What does it mean to you to be able to provide an experience like this for people on, you know, weddings, birthdays, just really special events for people? So I've like growing up, I've always wanted donkeys. And like when the opportunity finally arose, I kind of went overboard. I got six of them. But I just love sharing like how excited you got when you saw the donkeys or the hiker that came and saw us this morning. Like it's just so fun to share these donkeys with people that don't get to experience it every day. Right. They're really yeah. special animals. Uh, they're very well loved. OK, uh, here's the thing, you guys, you can book them for your next event. Uh, but that next event could also be maybe it's a hike and a picnic. That's right. They're rolling out a new opportunity for people and we are going to be back with them to tell you all about it in the next hour. I know you'll want to join yeah. us, so I hope you stick around. Very cute. Hey, Molly, Can you even? I, no, so I wanted to clarify <laughs> one thing. Did she say you could pick what, yes. what they could wear? You choose what they wear? Did you she say that? You can pick you choose what they wear. And in fact, we have a special story um, from this lady right here. Tell us about your wedding. 
Oh, okay. So <laughs> for my wedding, okay. me and my husband did not want to do a first look, but I convinced his brother and mother to go convince him that I was freaking out and that I needed to do the first look. I didn't want to have any nerves going down the aisle. Well, if you go ahead and look at little Rita over there, we actually dressed her up in a bride's outfit. Oh my, oh my god. When we did the fake first look for my fiance, Don't she walked in. <gasps> we <laughs> for the fiance, yeah, no. We um, had him turn around thinking it was me and really it was just our little donkey, no. our little Rita. So, and, and, gave us... and she had a cheeky little note for him too. Aww. That's, that's, that's adorable. Adorable. Yeah. Yeah, I love it. All right. Uh, like, thank you. Another time. Thank you for that story, Molly. We'll see you in a little bit. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> okay, bye guys. Thanks, that's Molly. Weird.